Ghana's $3 billion euro bond has been oversubscribed almost five times, with the country getting $14 billion of orders for the issuance of its 41-year euro bond. Ghana thus becomes the first country on the African continent to successfully raise $3 billion and the longest ever euro bond issued in sub-Saharan Africa. More in the following report. The bond market is one of the indicators to gauge the health of a country's economy. Oversubscription means the capital market's reaffirmation in the Ghanaian economy when the 2020 international bond issuance resulted in five times the amount required. It comes two weeks after Moody's credit rated the country B3 positive from stable. The $3 billion euro bond comes in tranches. West Africa's second biggest economy issued a $750 million euro bond with an average life of 40 years at 8.875%. According to Bloomberg data, this makes it the highest yielding sovereign dollar bond so far this year, with its pricing reduced from the initial 9.4%. The government also sold $1.25 billion of debt with an average maturity of six years and a yield of 6.375%. The third tranche of $1 billion has an average 14-year maturity, yielding 8%. Five local firms, Data Bank, IC Securities, GCB Bank, Fidelity Bank, and Strategic African Securities acted as local dealers for the euro bond issuance. The international partners who acted as arrangers and dealers are B of A Securities, JP Morgan, Morgan Stanley, Standard Bank, and Standard Chartered Bank. Government plans to use proceeds to finance the fiscal deficit, refinancing or repaying outstanding indebtedness, including the energy sector debt.